Hey girl, hey! I'm here to do quite an interesting video. If you have been on my channel before or seen some of my past videos, you might remember a very short series I did called Reading My Middle School Diary. A lot of you guys loved those and wanted to see more, but I'm honestly like afraid to look at my diaries after that, so. But I thought to go along with that, you need some visuals. You know, hearing is not enough. You've got to see my middle school self. So in this video, I am going back to my uh, MySpace roots and looking through some of my MySpace middle school pictures and reacting to them for you. If you want to paint the full picture, I would definitely recommend watching those reading my diary first. I'll link them both down below. But for now, let's just go and get into it. So MySpace was definitely my thing. Uh, I don't remember when I made mine. I want to say like sixth grade. And today, it still exists for all of you wondering. Um, it's a music site now. Stop trying to make MySpace happen. It's not going to happen. But I did find a way to get to my old pictures, so. This is just forewarning that these are like so painfully edited. Oh my God, like I literally just threw up in my mouth a little bit. Wow, here's a place to start. <laughs> Internally screaming. It literally scares me. Like, I scare myself looking at this picture. Did I think I was on, like, the cover of an all-time low album or something? So, yes, I did have a scene phase, but it wasn't, like, terribly seen. It was, like, uh... I have nothing to say for this. This is scaring me too much. We need to move on. Oh my god, you guys. Okay, so I'm going back and filming this later and editing it in because I found out where I can read the captions. <laughs> ah! The caption to this one, the black and white one, is the reason that I still believe dot dot. This looks like something I would do if I were doing a parody video of middle school. Camera, selfie, giant sunglasses. The only thing missing is duck lips at this point. I think this is the first day that I swept my bangs and I thought I was so cool. I literally look like I'm making fun of myself, but this is like serious things that I did. Like this is concerning. You can't even see half my face because it's so overexposed. Oh my God, all the song lyrics. This one is dot dot. Life is a maze and love is the riddle, dot dot. Can you just tell me where that fits in this picture at all? Like my life does not look like a maze as I gaze into the webcam. This is probably the most true to self photo I've posted on MySpace. I have nothing to say for this. I just was so addicted to taking pictures of myself on my computer, but this was probably the best thing that came out of it, TBH. Me as the Joker, I was in this like play that came to our middle school that did like one week plays. So they would put it all on in a week and I was cast as the jester. And I remember I was never more angry or upset in my entire life than when I had to be the jester because I wanted to be like a main princess person. But the ladies who ran the thing like tried to assure me that I got cast as the jester because you know, I was the best actor and no one else could be as convincing, blah, blah, blah. I wore this to a restaurant, I got lots of looks, oh man. This legitimately looks like I had green hair and I just, I don't know how this happens. Like what did I do to myself? Also that eyeliner though, Oh, I look like Barney with green hair and purple eyeliner. The caption is me dot photoshopped. At least I said that, praise the Lord. Um, and then after that I said and and two ampersands and Julia plus Kelsey own it. Does anyone, I completely forgot about that. On MySpace, if you had a picture up, your friends could comment like, I own it. Like I own this. Like what did that even mean? Like, and then you'd be like, okay, like Kelsey owns this picture. Like what? Like that was a thing, what? I remember thinking this picture was the coolest thing in the entire world and everyone would think that like, I was such a badass because I literally jumped a foot off a bench. A bench. The bangs, the glasses, the editing. I feel like I don't even have to react to these because they speak so much for themselves. But I will give you a memory that goes along with this picture. This boy that I was like talking to at the time, he, I was texting him. He said that his little brother saw the picture of me with like the old woman looking picture. And then he was like, ew. And then he told me that his little brother then saw this picture and was like, oh, okay, she's really cute. But let me just say like, you can't even see me in this picture. Like what? You <laughs> glasses cover half my face and it's so overexposed that you can't see anything else it's just like a joke of a picture the caption is harder better faster stronger i think i was referencing kanye west which is like kind of acceptable because of the glasses but like oh my god literally what the hell am i honestly i thought i was a model i thought i what? The sad thing is I probably took like 30,000 other pictures just to get this one. 
and then edited the heck out of it. Like, my bathroom's not pink. And also, lol, the chore chart in the corner, like, kick it at me. Wait, that's not even a chore chart. That's a wet to straight. Just, ugh. Does anyone remember the wet to straight straightener, which was probably so bad for your hair, but it was a straightener that, like, you could use when your hair was wet. And I made a chart of the levels for what I wanted for my hair. That was quintessential middle school. Everyone had one of those things. Also, where are my eyebrows? Like, RIP to my eyebrows. The caption here is love dot 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 pink dot 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 owner Shauna. Don't trust a hoe, she whispers under her breath as she pensively looks out the window, listening to a new 303 album. I miss those board shorts, those are really cute. Where's my nose? Also, again, with the green hair and the, what even, like, did I think my selfies were abstract art? Like, these colors, what? And this one is, I know this whole thing's wrong, but dot dot dot, baby, we're invincible. I don't even know what song that is at all. This one I'll include for fun, but like we took a picture with these guys. This is such a bad quality. These guys like asked for our numbers and we thought we were so cool and like so we like hung out with them and took pictures and like I hate myself. <laughs> and the caption is literally, they asked for our numbers. Oh my god. When you see it though. I forgot I did this. I would literally draw on eyeliner with like black, like an editing. Ah, it's so obvious too. It's not subtle. I'm like, look at my left eye kind of gets away with it because it's more in the shadow, but look at my right eye. Like it's so obvious. I probably use like Microsoft Paint for that shit. I'll just include this one for fun. Um, we were at, I want to say Polynesian Cultural Center in Hawaii. And um, I saw the picture of this guy. I took a picture of it, which is probably really creepy. And I thought it was the funniest thing ever. Like me and my friends were laughing so hard. And then as we walked away, we saw the guy come up and laugh at himself. <laughs> Cause it was like posted on the wall, like pictures they had taken. Okay, this one in the woods. Just like, look at my face. Like what's wrong there? Why did I, I just like, I don't understand why I thought people wouldn't notice these things. I literally like painted under my eyes so you couldn't see my under eye circles. Like that's not realistic. And also on my left eye, you could, it like overlaps my skin. Like, ugh. The caption is, we were scared, haha. Ha. I'm scared just looking at it. Okay, there's three things wrong with this. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna give you guys a minute to like figure them out for yourself because maybe I just like think it's so obvious because I know it's there, but I, I feel like it's very obvious. One, eyeliner drawn on my eyes again. Not as obvious in this one, but like two, I freaking covered up my under eye circles again, which looks so unrealistic. Like no one's eyes is shaped like that. Like, Three, on this one, I like drew in black on the left side of my face to make it look smaller. Like that's so sad. I don't even, like I forgot how much I edited these pictures. Like it's so sad. Are anyone else's pictures like this bad? Cause I feel like this is like real bad. You're gonna love this one. Is who I am hates who I've been. Incredibly relevant at the moment. All right, I think I'm gonna cut it off there just because I'm kind of getting into like the summer before freshman year now and um, it gets a lot better from there. So I think I got through some of the really bad ones. Uh, that was uh, truly something. After I finish filming this, I'm probably literally just gonna go scream into a pillow for like five years. I'm so sorry for anyone who had to witness that. I hope you found it entertaining. For me, this is like nails on a chalkboard, but like, I can deal. Oh, God bless my eighth grade soul. Okay, I'm going to go. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos in the future. Thumbs up if you made it to this point and for me being on the middle of the ocean. <laughs> I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I'm ready to be sure I never become that way again.